Welcome back, everyone. It's David O with Biddle MCOM. Consider this. You're working on your Premiere Pro video project on a computer at work or at school, and now you want to bring it home with you to work on it where it's a little more comfortable on a different machine. In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily save and transport all that info so you can keep working right where you left off. Let's get started. This project file contains lots of gigantic high-def footage, some audio, and some graphics. I want all of that saved just like it is so I can keep working on it at home. Edits, transitions, effects, I want it all. First, I'll click File, then click Project Manager. This screen will appear, so this is really important. I want to click everything that comes up in this sequence box. Remember, I want everything saved. Just below that, I need to make sure that Collect Files and Copy to New Location is selected. This should be the default setting, so this will likely already be selected. Under Destination Path, I'll just choose where I want to save this. And now, on the right side, under Options, you have some decisions to make. Primarily, whether or not you want to keep everything. And remember, I want everything. So, we're going to uncheck Exclude Unused Clips. If you leave this box selected, any clip that you haven't put in a sequence yet will not be saved. This is helpful if you're trying to consolidate, but very unhelpful if you're still building your project. So we want to unselect Exclude Unused Clips. Then just click OK. And depending on your project size and computer processing power, this can take a few minutes. Then after that's complete, just go to the save location and you'll see that all your files are saved and ready to be uploaded to a flash drive or Google Drive or some other type of portable storage. It is just as simple as that. If you have any questions, call, text, or email if you know me. If not, leave them down in the comments. Thanks for watching.